Hello students and welcome back to bankexamstudy.com. My name is Ramandeep Singh and today I am launching the RBI Grade B 2020 course by Team Bank Exams today. In this course, we are going to have a batch size of 50 students only. That's it. So that we can provide the best quality services to our students, right? So students, uh, why we are starting so early? Uh, see, uh, every year, the phase one exam is conducted in the month of July to you can say September. Anywhere between July to September, the phase one exam is conducted. And there is hardly a month, month a gap of one month between the phase one and phase two. So most of the students who comes to me, they start their preparation in the month of March, April or May. March, April, right? So how much time you are devoting? Most of the students, they are engineers. They have never gone through finance and management. And they try to crack this exam by, the, by doing the preparation for just three or four months. Is it possible to crack RBI grade B uh, by preparing within like three or four months? I think it's not. If you are an engineer, it's not possible. But if you are a commerce graduate or if you are preparing for UPSC, then yes, it is possible because the UPSC aspirants, they are already good at ESI, they are already good at general awareness and commerce graduates and the finance graduates, they are already good at finance and management. So if you have already cracked the IBPS PU level exams again, there, there is a higher probability. But if you are a fresher who do not know anything about RBI grade B, three or four months of preparation is not sufficient. So uh, this course for, is for all the students uh, who want to give a whole year, whole one year for this exam. That's why I'm starting so early. Only with 50, I know that not many students are going to subscribe for this. I know it's a difficult decision. Giving your one year uh, to, a, to an exam, right? I mean, um, it's difficult actually. Uh, while others are preparing for 2019, you are preparing for 2020. It is a little difficult, but yes, we are doing it. I know, I, I know that not many students are going to subscribe for that, but I am going to do this right along. I right now I have just four students I know who personally requested me, sir, please start the 2020 course. And on their request, I am starting this course with just four students. And if you want to join, you can join us. How we are going to do this? The first and the most important part of our RBI grade B preparation journey would be the RBI grade B GK digest. Our team, a team of content writers, what we do, we do the analysis of Yojana and Kurukshetra magazine, which is really, really important. And in that uh, previous month's uh, digest, we did the analysis of union budget. We also did the analysis of economic survey. We did this as well. In this magazine, we also do the analysis of PIBs. We also do the analysis of latest government schemes. And then we do the analysis of international reports. We, uh, we add up the financial awareness. Uh, RBA and uh, SEBI circulars, we do the analysis of RBA and SEBI circulars, we also do the current affairs. That's all we are doing in that RBA grade B GK digest and we compile all that information within like 70 to 80 pages, which is nothing. I mean, you can read the complete analysis within, I think uh, you can read it within a day or two, within one or two days. You can completely read this analysis. The complete analysis you can read within one or two days. That's it. Otherwise, if you start, you know, researching all, all of that, it will take more than 15 days normally. But we do all that for you because you need to read the RBA's website every day, SEBI's website every day. Uh, keep an eye on the government schemes. Keep an eye on the current affairs, on the financial awareness, on the PIB. Uh, and give like two or three days to these magazines but we do all of that for you and every month on 10th of every month we provide the analysis of previous month right so that's what rba grade b gk digest monthly magazine is and we are going to provide the rba grade b gk digest monthly magazine in this course in the general awareness there is banking and financial uh, awareness plus the economic news see students whatever is happening in that financial industries 
in the bond market whatever is happening uh, and the rbi circular rbi circulars or the sebi circulars are really important here any committee formed by rbi any committee formed by the sebi anything related to the financial markets anything related to you can say gst uh any changes in the taxation system even the union budget is part of it i would say union budget is also part of financial uh, you know financial system union budget economic survey all of that is part of it i would say uh so that is banking and uh a banking and financial plus economic economic news is really really important nowadays uh, we see the economic news in the finance and management paper as well so in the exam we are going to find 25 to 30 questions uh from the general awareness subject it is from phase one right 80 marks are allotted to the general awareness section right so for current affairs uh we do the analysis on rbi grade b gk digest and we do provide the analysis every month right uh every month and every day we are updating it on our website and that's also available for free so all the national international affairs the sports news the reports and indices awards summits conferences government schemes agreement deals all these topics are also really important for the esi that's why we are doing that in that rbi grid b gk digest uh some of the static questions will be there in the phase one uh, the important days parks dams thermal power point uh, power plants mountains temples stadiums uh not 10 to 12 question five to seven questions will be there from static topics okay let's move forward so students the exam is held in uh, two phases and then there is an interview so the general awareness is of 80 marks 80 questions are there english language 30 cognitive aptitude 30 and 60 uh, questions in the reasoning ability section total 120 minutes and 200 marks last year i think the cutoff was 105 uh, which is quite high i think uh, and then in phase two there is economic and social issues english writing skills and finance and management uh, the time duration the separate papers of 90 minutes uh, the paper one and paper three is objective and the english writing pair skills uh, it is a descriptive paper which you need to type on uh, the your computer screen so maximum marks 100 each okay so for the quantitative aptitude uh in the data interpretation maybe you'll be fi uh, finding like two sets uh so 10 marks 10 to 15 marks for data interpretation one or two questions from boats and streams time and work time speed and distance partnerships mixture allegation av uh, av averages and ages profit and loss percentages problem based on trains pipes and systems uh, area and volume i've never seen that but please do it number series like two or three question from number series linear or quadratic equation if it is there like three four marks and like data sufficient sometime it's there sometime it's not there so uh, i'm teaching the quantitative aptitude section myself okay you can check the demo lectures on youtube and even the demo courses available on bankexamstudy.com or the bank exam today's mobile app in the reasoning there is machine input output uh as it is of 60 marks uh, like five marks from in machine input output like uh, two or three puzzles will be there so 10 to 15 marks from puzzles like 15 to 20 marks from seating arrangement order and ranking zero to five inequalities always it is of five marks uh for that uh, critical reasoning for the statements and assumptions kind of questions like five marks coding decoding five marks uh, silox five blood relation like two three marks direction sense test like two three marks so that's the syllabus of reasoning ability english language uh one of our teachers uh they are going to teach you one of our team members the demos are available reading comprehension like i would say uh 10 marks most probably like error spotting five marks double fillers like five marks sentence rearrangement vocabulary based questions right sometimes vocab based questions are there sometimes close tests are there okay then economic and social issues the rbi grade b gk digest is the best study material available in the market for economic and social issues we do the daily analysis that is really important for esi section we do uh, analyze the government scheme committees by rbi sebi and central government we do the international reports we do the basic economic concepts that that we have already covered we do the analysis of union budget economic survey whatever the international report is there we do the analysis of that national reports we do the analysis of that 
so all those analysis are available in the uh, economic and social issues segment okay uh, then financial management in the financial management uh, basically uh, the financial management is there plus the financial awareness that we are covering in the RBI grade B GK digest again that's part of it this is the static portion this is the static portion that I'm just uh, listing down the financial system regulators of banking sector primary and secondary market risk management derivatives budget cost of capital capital structure capital budgeting leverages and rationals these are the static topics but nowadays the trend is of dynamic topics right uh, dynamic topics are, are covered in the RBA grid B GK digest whatever the committees are formed or the changes in the taxation system or any other new law or regulation made by the government of India so that's also important uh, for the financial management okay then the principles of management it is quite static so development of management thoughts chapter is there uh, Henry Fayol uh, scientific management system theory Hawthorne experiments part of syllabus a uh, few more uh, theories are there which i think i didn't add here then planning organizing staffing communication directing leadership hr so these are really important corporate governance and quality control these are also important topics we are covering all of them right so leadership theories and motivation theories are actually most important part of the whole uh, you know syllabus so that's all for today students if you want to join the RBI grade B 2020 course if you can commit that you are going to start your preparation for the 2020 exam and if you are one of them who want to give one year instead of you know waiting for the 2019 notification instead of starting your preparation and doing your preparation for just two months you are ready to give your 12 14 months for this exam then this course is for you right so we are providing the video classes notes test series rba grade b gk digest and i'll provide you the personal attention as see students at the time of exams we get a lot of calls but during like uh, uh, this period after the exam after 2019 exam nobody is going to call us right so uh, we are uh, we uh, we are going to be available for you i'll be available uh, 24 7 actually you can give me a whatsapp message and i'm going to answer you any time actually right so I'll provide you the personal attention. That's why I'm just taking 50 students after 50 students. I'm not going to take any student, right? Uh, the course will be freezed for everybody else, right? So uh, you can give me a call or you can drop me a WhatsApp message on 906720100 or install bank exams today mobile application or go to learn.bankexamstoday.com. So this is a list of our students who cracked RBA grade B 2018 exam. I so marketing exam. CB grade A, NABAD grade A, Vijaya Bank credit officer and Bank of India credit officer exam and trust me students all the all the students who are going to join the RBA grade B 2020 course in these months in the month of July and August trust me there will be a much higher probability to crack this exam in 2020 right so uh, if there is any doubt you can give me a call back so that's all for today students thank you and have a very very nice day bye